Where you are now, I was some 14 years ago. <clears throat> and what I would say to you is, I've watched a lot of football this year in the Championship. And you as a team, as a football club, is probably the best that I've seen. It's an absolute pleasure, one, to be invited and to come back and see some of the old faces and to see the transformation within the training ground. Um, it, it, it's something very special. It's transformation. It is having driven in this morning. It's unbelievable the way that it is changing, and, and it's great for the football club because it's the way the game is moving. To look at the pitches, uh, I thought we had very good pitches um, 14, 15 years ago. But I look at the pitches now; it's like an absolute carpet. So, credit to the football club, and it's great to see everywhere being developed. It was really good speaking to Daniel, uh, first off, um, managers to ex-managers that were, uh, and, and just see where he's at, if he's enjoying it, and what his thoughts are. And uh, we're very similar thoughts in, in how we approach the game, and, and he is a very upbeat, positive um, individual, and uh, hopefully he can drive the lads on and upwards for the next 11 games in, in, in game promotion. Uh, first time I've met Stuart, and uh, Stuart gave me the invite to come here today uh, for Alex Tetty's uh, presentation. So, very impressed what I've seen this morning and uh, the shape of a, a, of a club moving forward. What you guys Very good. I think it was just a case of I've been there, some of those haven't been there. Just carry on doing what they're doing. There's, there's no magic wand, they're winning football matches. Uh, I've seen Norwich City a number of times home and away this year and I've always been very impressed with the style of play, the energy that they've put into the game uh, and the results that they've achieved up to now. So if they carry on doing that over the next eight weeks or so, they're going to be in a fantastic position for the whole of not only Norwich City as a city but as a county and uh, there'll be a lot of green and yellow being worn. For anybody to spend that amount of time at a football club now is um, very, very rare and, and, and for Alex uh, to have achieved 207 games up to now I think it is a fantastic achievement and speaks volumes not only for him but for the club also uh, in wanting his services. So uh, absolutely delighted that I was asked to come and uh, present Alex with his, uh, with his shirt. I had a wonderful group of lads um, back when we got promotion in 2004, a wonderful group of lads. I see a very similar group with Daniel now, that there's a real camaraderie, there's a real closeness, real bond there, and that's something that's very, very important, and the reason why they've had an excellent season up to now, uh, and, and like all people close to Norwich City as a football club, we hope that they carry that on over the next 11 games and achieve what everybody wants. Uh, their work ethic, um, the way the players enjoy, uh, the football and the energy they put into the game it is fantastic. So you've got three wonderful things there which is part of a winning formula and if they can keep that going uh, then hopefully it will be all smiles around Norwich City and the county as a whole.